Ahoy there, I'm Captain Chris. I'm not a real captain, but I'm here to give you a short version of my very popular P&O drinks package video, so you'll know whether a package would be worth it for you. I'm going to whiz through this information, so be ready to hit the pause button for a closer look at the captions I'll be showing you. And remember, there's more detail in the longer version of this video, if you prefer. So there are four drinks packages, and the first one is called Refresh. It costs £10.95 per day, and it's aimed at kids, although adults can buy it too. It includes the obvious popular soft drinks, and if you drink about four each day, it would be worth it for you. The next one is called the Alcohol Free. It costs £24.95 per day, and it includes soft drinks, small cost of coffee, and non-alcoholic beer, wine, spirits, and cocktails. Get ready to press pause now, because here comes an example of the kind of amount you'd need to drink each day to break even with this package. The cheapest package to include alcohol is the Classic, and it costs £44.95 per day. If you buy this and you're travelling with children, they also get the Refresh package for free. As well as soft drinks and small cost of coffee, it includes beers, wines by the glass, single spirits, but not the premium brands, and cocktails. And if you want something that's not included in the package, you get a 20% discount on that. You have a limit of 15 alcoholic drinks per day, and get ready to press pause, because here comes an example of how to break even with this package. The dearest drinks package is called the Deluxe, and it costs a hefty £54.95 per day. It includes soft drinks, medium-sized Costa coffee, more choice of beers, large glasses of wine, and double measures of spirits. 20% off drinks not included, the refresh package for kids travelling with you, but even this package doesn't include every drink that's available on board. You're still limited to 15 alcoholic drinks per day, and get ready to press pause for your example of how to break even with this package. Remember that you're charged for your drinks package for every day of your cruise, so to break even with the drinks package, you need to be getting value from it on every day. But some of those days you'll be ashore for several hours, so you may not get value on those days. Now, it's possible to get a discount on the price of a drinks package, or use your onboard credit to buy one, or skip buying one for embarkation day when you might not get full use out of it, but not all three. So if you want to learn about that, or if you're travelling with a 17-year-old, or if you're travelling to the USA, or if you'd like to see some sample drinks menus, or if you want to know how they prevent you from sharing your drinks package with someone else, you'll need to watch the longer version of this video, and the link to that will be appearing down there in a few seconds. And until next time, please subscribe for more videos, and thanks for watching.